Everything you see in this video was completely authentic. You know, there wasn't any treatment, any budget, any planning. We just went with the flow and would have seen how things went. Naruto, Ninetale, Fox, Fox, Fox. I feel like a Gucci ad lip. Burr, go to the Coca Cola, mascot, polo burr. Put my salsa lasagna, it can make Garfield burr. I met um, Ski back in March at South by Southwest. Uh, it was like, in a, in a parking lot. Like we were just a bunch of people, we were all just in a parking lot. You know, we were talking and I, I told him like, I'm a fan of his music. And he told me he's a fan of my videos. And then he told me that I'm gonna shoot his first music video ever. I was like, let's do it. Shout out my mucus. Can you know that be my slide? It was my first time in New York. Ski's hotel was right in Times Square. So just being around there to me, my first time being in New York ever, it was like, a movie. It was like something I'd seen before, but never got to see in person. So I'm from Chicago. So, you know, Chance the Rapper is a huge, huge, huge inspiration. Chance and Austin Vesley, they did a video for Juice in Times Square like four or five years ago. And I remember seeing that and I thought it was the coolest thing. And, you know, seeing Times Square in a video and never being to Times Square, just it feels so surreal. It just, it doesn't seem like real life. A lot of the stuff that I used in this video and the visual effects was the first time I ever used it. I used the stock footage of a uh, vaporwave galaxy road to make it kind of look like water. It's called blobalized it. So I blobalized it and I softened it. I actually distorted it. I lined it up with the sidewalk. So it kind of went hand in hand with everything and it looked super natural. And I reversed it because usually the, the footage is going forward, but I reversed it so it's coming towards us, so as he's moving forward, it kind of looks as if he's walking faster than he is. Frame by frame, I masked out his legs and feet. Therefore, I could lay in this vapor wave behind him. One thing I always try to incorporate is fun colors and, and just aspects that will really catch the eye. That's what people want to see, you know? They want to see something that makes them happy, you know? Life's too serious, so I like my videos to kind of just take you out of the show and just have fun for a little bit. So we were hanging out in the hotel room and how Chucky kind of got pulled into it was Ski had recently just been carrying around the, the Chucky doll at the time. So I saw the Chucky doll and I was like, we definitely need to, to incorporate that. And Ski was all for it. Ski was like, you think I wasn't gonna bring him with? This is in his hotel room, actually. This is on an iron board. And it was like a perfect intro shot, I thought, and it kind of, uh, introduce Chucky into the video. So the stuff you're seeing through here is just pixel sorting. So I just laid a pixel sort effect, which pulls pieces and colors of the video in each frame and uh, kind of randomizes a, a glitch on them. I ain't really fucking with the nigga like a dyke. For this shot, it was a lot of fun because we just happened to see him there with their little tip jar next to him, taking photos. Ski gave him, you know, however much money, like a $20 bill. And I was like, we're shooting a music video. You guys want to be in it? Like, sure, you know what I mean? 20 bucks, let's do it. This Statue of Liberty right here, I think he's like hitting a dab or something. Everyone behind us has stopped. It was like we were like the center of attention. With every shot in this video, you you didn't know what to expect. Someone could look at you crazy or someone could hop in the video and start dancing with the ski. It could have went any different way. So with every shot we took, it was fun because we didn't really know what was gonna happen. So right here, you'll see a family. They were caught off guard for sure. Bills on me blue, uh -huh, like a bruise, uh -huh, better yet. That's that's gold right there. That's perfect. When when he lifted up his arm and you know shook back and forth and and put on this face, I knew that it was gonna be big. I magnified his eyes and uh, feathered it out so it looked natural and it looked as if he had bug eyes. Whoa, go on, shake that ass like vibration on my belly. Shook. I uh, was just hanging out the front seat, you know, like half my half my torso was hanging out. This actually isn't even his hat. Uh, it's one of uh, it's one of his boys' hats, and uh, he's like, "Yo, like, let me just wear this hat for the video." This is our boy Mike. He's like, "Whatever you do, just don't lose the hat, man. Just don't lose the hat." Before we left out, and Ski's like, "Come on, man. Like, I got you. I'm not gonna lose the hat." A few hundred more feet, we pull over because Ski's like, "I gotta go get the hat." You know what I'm saying? He's, he made it very clear that I shouldn't lose the hat. So he's sprinting. Runs around the corner. He was looking around everywhere. He couldn't find it. He's like, I lost it. He's like, I'll just pay him whatever the hat costs. So he gave him like, he gave him like 200 bucks or something just because he felt so bad. After the hat fell off and we kind of realized it was gone, you know, that kind of just set the tone and we're like, you know, we're going to end it there. We got a lot of footage. 
directing is like bringing an idea to life. So sometimes I'll have ideas written down on paper and then seeing that happen is one thing. And then being able to put it out and release it and see it get sometimes millions of views, that's, that's incredible. The editing process, it's like playing a video game. It's like the same joy that I had when I was a kid playing video games, but I'm productive. Me and Ski, you know, we have a very personal relationship. It's like before anything, we're just like friends, you know, it just clicked. The YouTube channel has almost turned into a platform. So I can give people opportunities and I can really break new artists. And that's so fun to me because I can handpick someone who I really believe in, do a video for them, and you know, if if enough people agree with me as far as, you know, the talent or if they enjoy the artist, then bam, you know, that that might be a chance to to break them and, and possibly change their life. Yo. Hey, 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 hey. Chucky like the sip, I seen the whole thing. I seen the whole yeah, video, man. No. Chucky's a wild boy. Yeah, no, Chucky, he was he was definitely getting lit.